Well, hello everyone. My name is Justin. This is Our Gutless Life. Welcome back, Dark Solians. We are in the New Londo Dark Wraith Undead area. We have... We just finished this little uh, gathering of Dark Wraiths. We went up and we got the Ember, which I totally failed to remember. And now we're going to finish clearing this place out. Whoa! Keep that under control there, buddy. Yay! A chunk! Everybody loves chunks. So when you when you die and come running back, you can jump from up there to this archway top and then just come down here. Pretty nifty. More cracked red eye orbs. I think that's only the second place in the entire game that you can uh, find them. Whoa! I am not doing much damage at all. Ouch. But oh, another chunk? Another. Oh, mm, nope. I don't remember if there's anything down here. Oh no, there's not. That's the elevator we came in on. Straight ahead is where we fought the Drakes and the 99 Dragons. Or of the. And this way is the further clear out slash kill the Dark Wraiths. I think there's a Shagahod in here. And of course the uh, Black. Nope, Dark Wraiths. Oh my goodness, there are two. Two right in a row. It's time to do some... Please don't attack me firewalls. <laughs> he is doing his little look how cool I am combo. But then he, he died. Whoa! <laughs> Where does he keep that spike? Uh, I think, yep, you just spit out a exploding head. Oh, I don't want to be blown on. And I believe that's it. There are no more of those big black guys left in the, the slimy, oily, multi-face guys with the big spear in his face. I think that's it for the whole rest of the game, just those two. So there's that, and I think there's only one Dark Wraith, no it's a good chest, there's only one Dark Wraith uh, left. I'm pretty sure there's a Dark Wraith behind this wall. No, it's, that's not going to work for me, there's no way I'm that lucky. So I was excited to fight the four kings, but I totally forgot that you need a uh, puppy help. Oh, I just talked about how this was the last guy, and then I forgot. I forgot he was there. Oh wait, no, there is one more. Dark Wraith. So when we come back, we're going to totally summon uh, Beat Rice there, and yes, it's Beatrice but it's spelled beet rice. Anyway, we're going to go fight the puppy to get a ring, and then we can come back and fight for the abyss. <laughs> this is totally an invisible wall. Nope, illusionary wall. Give me a, nope, nothing. I think that's it for... Oh, please don't fall. I think that's it for everything down here. Now we just come back with the ring, and that's everything looted. So, we need to go back to the... Uh, uh, Andre the Giant, give him the ember, so that we can uh, upgrade our bow. Now, because it's a long-range bow, um, it's not as 
good for damage as the longbow, but if something's going to be in longbow range, I'll just throw a fire orb at it. But the long range bow, I don't know if I want a 15 bow or if I want like a fire bow or oh, lightning. Well, I'll be. That's a brilliant ember you've got there. I sure do. For all my years in the trade, that might be the finest. Who's about? You leave that ember with me. Are you jelly? I'm just an old smith. I'd give my left arm for a gem like that. Sold. Give me your left arm. Well, thank you mightily for that. Now, just leave the rest to me. Andre of Astora gets the job done. You shall see. Okay. There are two types of weapons. Oh yeah, blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. I think I do want... Yeah, I'll make it 15. Because I can always increase my... Hmm, where'd it go? Always increase my... Uh, dexterity. Or agility. Or... I actually don't know what it's called anymore. Go get your... How, how did I forget what this is called? It is called dexterity. I can always increase my dexterity to make the bow do more. Oh, yeah, you can have a dark ember. Yes. I'll be seeing. Anything saying. else to hand you there, buddy? Well, uh, nope. Oh, I need large shards. Shoot! All right, chunk it up, chunky monkey, and then fifteen. There's my last. Uh, Slab. Now I know where two, three more are. I guess. I don't remember. But now that I know that Twinkling Titanite comes from those uh, crab guys, I wonder if you can farm them. Although it is a really long run in the lake and there's only like three of them. Hmm. I don't know. I'll have to think of it. But for the time being, I have a plus 15 bow. I, uh, I have nothing for my armor. And then uh, I'll just buy, buy 99, 99 arrows. Alright. I'll get you. Sweet. I think next... Oh yeah, Sif. I'm in the area of Sif. Let's look at our uh, box to put things we don't need up. I really should just sell those. Well, maybe I should keep them. I don't know. Humanity. Sure. I don't need I don't need any of those shards. I should put away those things so it makes switching faster. I don't need the composite bow. I remember as a kid pronouncing composite. I don't need a spider shield. The I don't need the crush shield either. In uh, the sh the spider shield protects you from poison buildup and stuff. And toxic, I think. It's actually extremely nice. Uh, if you can see the white writing on the very bottom, it says that a right click is deposit all to box. I don't know what that equates to, because right click would just close out, because it's a strong attack. I don't know with the mouse fix like what it translates to, so I've never been able to use it. Oh, when I was farming for the uh, demon spear, I saved up enough souls to buy the 345 feather arrows, which have a, a longer range. Makes them uh, effective for sniping. We're gonna kill Manus with our long range bow 
our feather arrows and our ring that increases our bow range. I bought giant armor. I sold everything else, um, the different sets. Kurt, I think this is 40% more damage, but I, being, being low health to get a damage boost uh, makes me too scared. All right, 34. Sweet. I think that's all the vitality we need at 30. Maybe we'll put it to 40, but I doubt it. The next is attunement and then dexterity. I don't need any more endurance or strength or resistance, intelligence, or faith. Um, I don't even think I even need more attunement. Because I think now... Yeah, I have to go to 30 to get seven slots, or maybe it's 28. No, I don't. I don't remember. Do I have 12,000 soul worth of items? This is 10. No, it's five. Ooh, I don't think I have enough. No, well, these are three. Maybe. Do you, do you remember what it was? 326, let's 327. 32. Yeah, alright. See, yeah, it, the hit points went from 30, 33, 34, to now it's 23. So that's a sharp decline. I don't think I need that. Oh, maybe I should, because just putting one point in attunement and not get anything is kind of obnoxious. Dexterity increases my bow damage by 9. Woo! No, we're gonna, we're gonna go attunement. We're gonna go for seven, 7 slots so that I can have either a, probably the great chaos fireball, get rid of one of my fire orbs because the Great Chaos Fireball takes two slots. Oh well. We'll see. Uh, now it's Sif time. I don't know... I don't know if there's anything special about Sif. I think he's just a standard... I think that little tree... It's just a standard uh, tank and spank, as it's called. Not shake and bake. Tank and spank. I've heard that phrase so many times in World of Warcraft. Nope. Stay away, tree man. Oh, I don't think I've actually finished clearing out the forest. I think there's still a bunch of stuff for me to do here. I am done down the way at the Moonlit Butterfly, but I did not get the armor. I think it's the ninja armor in there. Alright, so let's go play with some uh, Forest Guardian Jerks. I think it'll just be faster to murder them as opposed to getting them to fall off a uh... whoa come back here fall off of the stairs oh in your face in your face uh, so I think this guy's wearing the you can't see me ring I don't know I don't remember what it's called Fog? Ring of Fog? Whoa! Sorry, I didn't know where you went. <laughs> Take that, dead body. Oh, I'm tur all turned around. 
If I would actually thought about it better, ow, I would have signed up with this, with these people before I became level two with the Daughter of Chaos so that I could have access to a vendor. Oh yeah, and then you can kill the vendor and get like a ring or something? I don't remember. As, as you can tell, I haven't really done that too much, and I don't, I don't remember. Uh, for, for whatever reason, these trees are like way tougher than the other trees you start with. You're, when I say start with, I mean that start in this area. Whoa, 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 whoa. They are coming out of the woodwork. <laughs> They're coming out of the walls. They are the walls. They're made of wood. That thing they just did, that's a that's a grab and eat your face off. And it is extremely dangerous. <laughs> I can hear them, but I don't see them. Oh no, no grabby. Keep your hands to yourself. Hashtag tree two. M me, me tree two. Uh, I think it's the same move set and everything for the DLC forest. There's the well, that's the Eastern set ninja stuff or samurai, w whatever. I don't know. Uh, the scarecrows. I think it's that same, the same model, not the same model, the, the same frame and just a different, just a different model, but same attacks, same uh, movement, no grabbing. Sweet. And I believe that's all the trees. Nor uh, that's where the Hydra hangs out down there. Hail Hydra. But I don't think there's anything else here. Oh no, there's this. I think we need to go down first and then up. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's over there, that's where the mushrooms are, I believe. And you just come down here for a soul. Soul. Uh, you can be crazy and walk, around, walk along this little edge to go over to that uh, bridge, which takes you down to the base of the waterfall where you fight the Hydra. This game is so awesome with its level design and back and forth it's it's really impressive the way they are able to uh, connect the levels I'm cautious but I don't remember what this is I mean I see the kitty cat but I don't know why I feel like this is a bad area oh yeah they roll at you and they're really Strong. Well, that was less strong than you might appreciate. Oh yeah, and they come in two. Or two now. I think this is the only kitty cats in the game. The Force Covenant Lady is one of these, but a little smaller and white. It sounded like a, a doom zombie. Whoa. He decided he wasn't going to take that fire. <laughs> Those trees really uh, <laughs> mess them up. Alright, kitty cat. You're all done now. It's just those three. And then we cycle around here to uh, mushrooms. 
I think the last time I was here, the mushrooms punched my face off. Which we don't want to do again. Uh, I think I have a better... Yeah, I have a better range on the weapon now. So I'm just going to play with them from far away and be very cautious. I don't think the little ones actually attack you, so you don't need to worry about them. And that's the... Whoa, whoa, whoa! That's the cue for them to uh, sneak up on me and murder my little butt. Ha-ha! <laughs> Shit-talky mushroom punk. Actually, now I feel kind of bad because gold pine resin, sweet. I feel bad because they make such little, cute little sounds. I don't know if they're uh, babies or like a different subgenre of race, I guess species. But I really know. Oh, dang it, I messed up the joke. Let me start over. All I know is that these guys are really fun to hang around. Because they're, they really are a fun guy. That's right. That's right. I thought about that joke and it took me like 40 seconds to bring it up and phrase it. You're welcome. Where are you going? <laughs> I'm 0 for 3 on that particular... Uh, attack. Enchanted Ember! We, we can give that to uh, Rickert. See what the party Rick does. I don't think there is a, a point to killing these guys, but it is somehow oddly satisfying. Yeah, take that. I think I have enough spells to fight. Uh, oop, nope, sorry. Put, put that back on. To fight the uh, Sif. So I have a great combustion. I think the fire orbs, I don't see me using more than 13. And then I have the eight great combustion. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm good to go, and I have 19 healing. I don't know if there's any other items up there. I hear you. Here we go, jump attack. Sweet. Jump attack number two. Uh, shoot. Alright, so I'm going to go murder a giant puppy. Not really murder. It's more like murder. Alright, I think we are good to go. Uh, put on my Chloranthi ring. And then just remember to put that stuff on when I succeed. We're doing a little save. I don't think it's really necessary, but you never know. Alright. Here we go! So this sword is obviously too big for a human to wield. And the grave stone is exaggerated. Is it that in this reality the uh, the sword and the gravestone are bigger and Sif is just a normal sized wolf in his own dimension but here he's blown out of proportion? Or is it that he really really did 
grow gigantic, and Arcturus was 20 feet tall. Hey, Rachel, you want to look at this cutscene? Say say hi, Rachel. Hello. Okay, so this is this is Dark Souls, and this is a fight against the boss Sif, S I F. Okay. Okay. Here, here we go. That's me. Oh, and that's a giant sword. Oh. Okay. Is that it? That's it. That's it. Sif. That's Sif. He's giant. giant sword. And he fights with a big ass sword in his mouth. Oh. I bet you never had a dog do that. Correct. Man, what a bitch. <laughs> no, not not you, the uh, mm -hmm. female dog. Mm -hmm. Whoa there, buddy. I feel like because he's so big that maybe that's like a disadvantage. Because you could be like fast. I am I'm very fast. Well I'm very fast. Not really. <laughs> I'm the fastest of all the video games here. Uh this oh, I I'm out of combustion. Excuse my very poor Donald Trump impersonation. This wolf is, is bigly. Is what? Bigly. Bigly? Bigly, yeah. As in, like, large? <laughs> Something like that. Hmm. Oh, look at his little limping. Uh, oh, oh, dang wait, it. Oh, wait, oh. what's Stop happening? That. I'm trying to put on a hat. And what's going on? Did you win? I won, and now look at my hat. What? It's a mimic. They pretend It's a monster. It pretends to be a treasure chest, and you go to open it. With giant teeth? Those are actually fingers. But yeah, it looks like Gross. teeth, and there's the tongue. But when you try to open it, it uh, stands up and then it eats you. So why is that on your face? This is a an item I got from the mimic that gives me more uh, a more a, a bigger reward for killing stuff. It's called the symbol of avarice. If you have that thing on your head. If I have this thing on my head, yes. That's like really bizarre. <laughs> yeah. And weird. And then I wear this pretty little hat get it. with wings to increase my magic damage. Thank you. I want a hat with wings. You look really good. By the way, that uh, that crown you were wearing earlier, that looked really good on you. Oh, thanks. Yeah, I was wearing a crown. In case anybody was wondering. It was like a wreath. Because sometimes, sometimes you just gotta wear a flower crown. I support that. Thanks. <gasps> oh gosh. Damn. I thought this would curve up and around, but instead I almost You're like about to fall off the cliff, Fall off friend. the edge of the world. <laughs> she, your character runs like um, Phoebe on Friends. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You remember that one where she's like flailing? Then, like, Rachel didn't want to associate with her or run with her. Right. Did you see that Weinstein was like, Jennifer Aniston, Jennifer Aniston should be killed? Yeah. The... What a punk. Yeah, that's one word for it. I guess he was more of a Monica. <laughs> There's a little talking kitty cat, but we're not going to talk to her. But there she is. So cute. All right. Well, uh, we've we've now murdered Sif, and we have his ring, or his master's ring, or Torius's ring, that we can survive the uh, abyss. So we are going to we I am going to end this here. I'm not doing anything. Yeah, <laughs> you do it all, baby. <laughs> and then we are going to uh, in the next episode we're gonna kill the four kings. You. I'm gonna try. Oh. It says there are four kings, but there's more of them, and there is zero frankincense room. Disappointing. That is, that is disappointing. Uh -huh. we're, we're working our way. Alright, so that's, uh, that's, uh, Mario. That's it. You up there. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Okay, uh, remember to be good to each other and loving and uplift one another. Call your mom, for goodness sake. Call your mom. Bye. What are you going to call her? <laughs> um, mom. M Mommykins? Yeah, okay. Okay, bye. Goodbye.